please like this video leave a comment and don't forget to share all right welcome to scanning tv on youtube once again this is isaac dogby he is back in ghana after winning over joette gomez just last month so i'm just going to allow you to listen to the full interview that he had in ghana what did he say about beating joette gomez and what is his expectation is he going forward to win the title for ghana yes we are going to look at it so don't forget that he beat joette gomez on a split decision yes um he actually took that 10th round very seriously that was when he made everything over joette gomez last month and he won that particular bout in the united states of america so let's listen to him as he went or he returned to ghana and we actually caught him in this interview so let's listen to us do way before then smash on the subscribe button put on the bell for more updates here on this channel don't forget that this video is also sponsored by intercorp they will help you to import anything from spain so just contact them and they are going to help you out let's listen to isaac dogbe in ghana i'm sure you probably may not be surprised at this kind of welcome first and foremost i like, I like to say it is really admirable to see the love that people show all, all these years um, but however with saying that I'm saying that I'm very grateful however the work is not done you know we are only halfway through um, my team and I we are very goal orientated people and um, we believe that when, 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 when the job is getting done you have to go all the way before we can start celebrations. I know this will be some sort of pre-celebrations just to just to let the people know that we are grateful to God, just to also th tell God that we are grateful to him for the victories, for the, you know, for the stepping stones, you know, for the gradual process that um, that, 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 that he's been given, um, that, that we, are, we, are, we are heading towards the bigger goal. You know, that is um, really important. But I know within myself and the rest of my team, the work isn't done. This is just um, the beginning, before the main work, before we get to the to the to the main to the main challenge. That's the world title. Well, um, as as we speak, it's relaxation time. Time to you know cool off a little bit. How's it going to be like for you uh, back here at home now that you uh, you finally touched down? Well, you know. Um, we, 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 I mean, we, we left with, um, with, 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 with prayers, saying that God should grant us favor, you know, and indeed he did. Um, and all the support that we received from our sponsors, especially um, Niche Coco Ghana, they played a tremendous part in my progress, you know, especially in this fight. This was a very, very, this, uh, this was a very, very important fight. And they came on board at the right time, at the very, very right time. You know to, to to sponsor me going into this fight um with that being said with that being said look oh thank you so much miss ah you see i didn't say that myself though. <laughs> and you know i would also love to say um a big thank you to the nsa national sports authority and the gba as well for their stern support and all the people in the Ministry of Sports as well, um, and all the people that are here, um, you know, I see many, many familiar faces. All you media um, personnel, uh, media houses, you guys have also played, also has also played, has also played a, tri um, a huge part in the, in the um, you know, in the, in the, in my progress. I would also like to say a big um, thank you to my church people and all the people that are always praying for me, you know. It is one thing, it is one thing doing the physical work, but we all need people to pray for you and with you, you know, for God to answer prayers because they say that the voice of the people is the voice of God. And um, I'm very, very thankful to each and every individual that goes to bed at night and says and remembers me, remembers me in their prayers. Um, my dearest uncle, Prophet Wobulu of the ARS, you know, and all the other people that are here today. People have traveled, you know, far, 
you know, very, very far to come to meet me here today, and I'm very, very grateful. Very, very grateful. Isaac, it's been a tiring trip. Uh, we're going to let you off in a few moments, so you go. But I need you to tell me about uh, considerations that will be made by your team uh, in going forward, because now that you have won this bout, there are a few options that you need to take uh, towards the end of the year to know what the way forward will be. When will uh, decisions be taken regarding the next step? Because the WBC is staring you in the face, the WBO also staring you in the face. Look, as soon as we finish the fight, the first call I made was the top rank and I asked them, so you know, if 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 if, if they were if they if they understood the Ghana vibe, I'd be like, "Yo, Charlie, so right now, what's up?" <laughs> you know, but it wasn't like that. It was a little bit more diplomatic, you know. Yeah. So I spoke with them and I was like, "Hey, so what's what's next?" You know, um, as the as we are finished and close this chapter, we look towards the next one. And according to them, they said I should, we should be looking towards um, ending of the year. So when God permits, the ending of the year, you know, we are waiting for the for the news to come up for what 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 what's in store for us. Um, they've given me many options, so I'm yet to also, you know, I'm yet to also uh, ponder over it and then um, seek guidance and also make a make an make an important decision because the next stages, the next stage of my life and the next stage of my career is very, very important as a decision that we take from here on. Thank you very much, Isaac. We'll just take uh, quick words from, um, you know, we saw you, we saw you in a short video jubilating very heavily when Isaac Dobe won this bout. Um, you also declared massive support for him, especially because he had taken a decision to support the cause of uh, contributing to uh, the development levy that has always been a problematic one. Um, I mean, tell me, where 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 your excitement levels lie especially after seeing him i mean we all celebrated the, the win together but now he's finally here at home and he's gotten to the next major stage of his career like he says yes uh first uh, we have to thank the lord uh isaac just said it's uh, it is through the help of god that we are here today the ghana boxing we are happy because uh, we are close to the wet title this is the final elimination bout and uh, at this moment, Isaac happens to be the eye of Ghana. Uh, as a president, uh, I want titles. So, and the WBC title is one of the biggest also. So if Isaac is going for the WBC title, it's a joy. And it's something that all Ghanaians should be happy. Uh, one thing about Dogbe is the discipline. We, we know he will go and bring the title. The entire GBA is happy. Uh, I know all Ghanaians are happy. Uh, by the end of the year, we'll bring the world title to Ghana. Uh, we'll need your prayers and also support uh, to Isaac Dobe and the boxing as a family. Uh, we are promising you that before the end of the year, Isaac Dobe will bring the world title to Ghana. Mm. Yes. Thank you very much, President. And uh, yes. Isaac, have a wonderful time. Subscribe to the channel and hit on the notification bell for 